Hey, welcome back to the channel guys. Today we are going to take a closer look at Wisteria, Night Hag Lilith. She's an original character by my ethos and when I first saw this back in May of 2019, so May of this year, I was like, wow, that's uh, some pretty cool art. It was on the back of the box. So I took a closer look at the figure and I was like, holy crap, this is gorgeous. So I went ahead and I bought it. Now, my ethos is a Chinese company, but unlike the bootleggers of China, this is a like legitimate company and they probably have some of the most beautiful pieces of like renditions of anime characters like that Gilgamesh that I unboxed earlier. Anyways, let's go ahead and unbox her. Alright, she is out of her box and she does come with a really cool like art card. Here's the envelope that it came in. Super fancy. And here she is in her box. So she's protected uh, from scuffing by all of these like layers of plastic. Here is the figure herself. Just so much plastic. It's a pretty cool base. But yep. Let's go ahead and put her over here. And now over here, right under the main package is the rest of the stuff like the wings of the dead dragon thing and most importantly her scythe all right it's time for assembly so first let's go ahead and put one or the left wing onto the base you can lift the rib up and snap it into place like so and now for the right wing same thing, only held by two pegs this time. There you go. That's the dragon portion. I think it's a dragon. And now for the scythe, it has a little peg on the bottom of the scythe to like retain it uh, onto the base, it prevents it from moving. And uh, Lilith actually holds the scythe in her left hand. And there you go. Okay guys, time for the close-ups, and holy crap, where do I begin? This is easily one of the best figures that I have ever owned. She is just a beauty. Look at that. The base is gorgeous. The little other stuff like this totem made of bones even though it's dark it's so so detailed she probably has the be best face of any figure that i own look at that face sculpt gorgeous love the eyes too even with the little stuff like uh this necklace or choker or whatever we can see detail in that skull that she is wearing they use glossy paint uh, to accentuate the dress that she has. Wow, look at those legs. Whew. Here's the uh, bottom of the base. She's standing on like the uh, carcass or skeleton of a dragon. That hair. Oh man. Wow. They have captured like female uh, body 280 look at that I honestly haven't seen or noticed it but the uh, the bones do make a heart <laughs> holy crap wow do like how the uh, hair droops over the heart gives it like a more unique more animated look and the shoe has like 
It's made from like a skull or something. We can see teeth at the uh, at the sole of the shoe. Oh man. Well, there you guys have it. Lilith, the Night Hag, by my ethos. All right, end of the video. And as usual, I will give the positives and the negatives of this figure. I believe that my ethos definitely knocked this out of the park, just like Stardust or Gilgamesh uh, that I also own. Um, she is actually probably one of the best figures, like, that I own. Uh, and if you guys do want her, I'll post a link down in the description of, like, some sites that you can currently get her in. You can't really see her in my figure collection because she is from a Chinese company and it's not, like, anime related. Which is dumb, I think, on my figure collection's behalf. Um, if you guys want to like support my channel, I'd appreciate if you shared this video and gave me some tips and advice on how I can make these videos better. Anyways, uh, leave a comment down there. And if you liked this video, appreciate a like, a subscribe, and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.